All right, welcome to the Dozen Trivia here on YouTube. It's our final matches of the first round of the Dozen 1v1 tournament. The regular season of the Dozen is coming back very soon. Please subscribe to the channel. All of the matches for the Dozen Trivia League Season 4 and on will be on this channel. We're trying to get as many people over here as possible. So please, if you can, do that. Like the video as well. Final matches of the first round. If you've missed first round matches, please catch up. You're about to see a couple fan favorite teams players here. The experts, Fran. Uh, leading vote getter in the All-Star game. She's taking on fights, the Boost Ponies, and then the back-to-back-to-back uh, -to -back -to -back MVP and reigning champion of the dozen, Kirk Minahan, the number one overall seed, taking on also from the Boost Ponies, Will Compton. Again, subscribe, like the video, and head to DailyDozenTrivia.com every single day to test your skills uh, and your trivia knowledge. Thank you for watching. We appreciate it. Enjoy. Welcome to the following presentation of the Dozen Trivia by Barstool Sports. Is Carl. it Crime Dog, Fred McGriff? <laughs> Jesus, how in the hell? The Hungers are your champions. Unbelievable. <laughs> uh, the movie's called Get Fucked. <laughs> hey, Jack. Yes! Champions of the dozen. Holy shit. Holy shit. All right, it's the Dozen 1v1 Battle Royale 2023. We have two first-round matches to go and a final first-round doubleheader here as we fill up the entire second round. It's the four seed from the experts. Fran taking on the 29 seed from the Booze Ponies. Fights, you are on the upset side of the bracket, I will note. The left side of the bracket has seen quite a few upsets. Uh, Roan, small upset over Chief. Keegs. Held it together, beat uh, Joey, but Frank the Tank upset Glenny Balls. Rudy upset Gia. Fran, the, the sister matchup no more. Gia just stumbled at the end there. It was tough. Yeah, so she, she's very upset about it. So uh, <laughs> yeah. I, will not, I will not comment yeah. to uh, rub salt in the wound. <laughs> and then Nick did avoid an upset from Trent. Trent played well. He moved on. Clemmer upset uh, large. The other side of the bracket, you got Che versus PFT in the second round. Brandon Walker versus Titus. Clem versus Ken Jack and Eddie versus KB. KB remains the only person to not miss a question yet. He went nine for nine in his knockout of Blaze. What a freak. Uh, yeah, it's KB is going to be KB's going to be a problem. Um, when when you're hitting Pennsylvania public school districts with no. these, oh, you need to go to school there. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. Yeah. Yeah, or oh, or like he didn't even get to we didn't even get to one of his categories. It's junior college and California community college sports nicknames. <laughs> just just ridiculous. What? Um, this matchup though is fun. This this is fights fights went with the most unique strategy for his. Fran has some of her usual ones. Uh, here's how this works. We'll explain since the beginning of the doubleheader here. Winner takes on Rudy. Uh, they selected eight categories. Uh, four of them, they select to repeat. The repeating will be a little more difficult than the other ones. They'll have a little bit more of a, of a higher difficulty to them. You have three lifelines. You can double up two of the regular difficulty categories, and then you can double up one of the hard difficulty categories. Fran will give John his first category. Fights will then throw it back to Fran with her category, so on and so forth, uh, until we have our winner. A couple, some higher, a little bit of high scoring the last couple winners, but usually it's in like, the highest scoring has been about 10 to the 12 range. That's what we've been averaging. Uh, Fran, people have said this for a while. We gave, we got these categories months ago. Is there anything? I mean, she, well, let's review the categories first. Then we'll see if there's any categories yeah. you guys might be regretting. Oh, what? Are people complaining that they wanted to, that they wanted to change stuff? <laughs> They're like, well, Mark Titus, for example, you have him getting it right. But he's like, when I picked these, I was watching Laguna Beach pretty re right, religiously. Right, right. No, I, that's super fair. I actually thought the same thing. I just said to Kelly, I was like, I was, uh, I was deep into like a One Direction re-listen and I just threw like Midnight Memories on here. And then today I was like, why did I do that? So, yeah, that's, no, there's definitely. That's something. what most people are saying. Yeah. So let's see. Let's look at Fights is first. Fights, Fights did all television. It's just TV. <laughs> and he picked, it's, it's, it's very funny. Um, 30 Rock, Parks and Rec, Care Beer Enthusiasm, Veep, Always Sunny, New Girl, The Office, Seinfeld. The repeating will be always sunny, new girl, the office, Seinfeld. Uh, no steals wow. in this, obviously. What, um, what a guy who just loves to laugh, you know? 
<laughs> <laughs> I I once I heard I was playing Fran, I was like, fuck, she can steal a lot of these. Uh, but luckily there are no steals. That is fights, all TV, all comedies. Uh, Fran, a bunch of the usual ones. If you're a dozen fan, you'll recognize Harry Potter's on there, but Prisoner of Azkaban, uh, One Tree Hill, One Direction, High School Musical, Celebrity Mashup, Jonas Brothers, the Lizzie McGuire movie, uh, and romantic comedies. Repeating will be Celebrity Mashup, Jonas Brothers, Lizzie McGuire movie, and romantic comedies. I did watch the entire Lizzie McGuire movie last night. Uh, well, what'd you think? 10 out of 10, right? It's, it's, I, I always forget that Miranda's just not in that movie. Just not yeah, in no, it. She, yeah, no. Uh, no, I think that was a personal thing with the actress. <laughs> yeah. All right, Fran, toss one over to fight. Let's, let's start it out. All right, John, we'll go with, uh, right, let's start with Parks and Rec. Fuck. One Parks of my, and Rec. Not one of my best ones. John okay, and I here are also, we go. I just want to say we're wearing the same shoes today. I saw, notice that in the hallway. We are in matching Birkenstocks. <laughs> Burke Boston gang. <laughs> John, Parks and Rec. Here we go. First question. In season three, episode three, Leslie tries to organize a Pawnee time capsule, but the inclusion of what book creates problems? Twilight. Final answer? Yes, final answer. That is correct. Bang. One nothing fights off the bat here. Reminder, Boost Ponies and the experts, both of their teams, are already in season four. They don't have to play in the playing tournament. They will be there starting in November. Uh, John, what are you going to give Fran? Let's see here. You, uh, I'm going to start Fran off. Here, I'm going to explain what my attempt is here. I'm going <laughs> to let you behind the curtain a little bit. You said everyone's been saving the hard ones. I'm going to hope to stump Fran on a hard one and maybe shake her confidence a little bit. So I'm going to go hard rom-coms. Okay. Hard romantic comedies. Here we go. Uh, one point, Fran, not going to double? No, no, I'm no. Okay. This one. There we go. For Fran to make it one nothing. A critical failure, that awkward moment at 40 million and starts Zac Efron, Miles Teller, and what actor who played Mikey? It's Zach. Michael B. Jordan. Damn. Final answer. That is correct. But Fight's also a rom-com guy, too, so I was trying to see if I could read yeah. a poker face there. Bro, uh, I have, uh, in my living room, I have that movie poster framed <laughs> autographed by the cast. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's the only thing hanging in my living room. <laughs> I got Imogen Boots' autograph on it. I got MB. Oh, wow, even the supporting. <laughs> yeah. Was that a gifter? <laughs> it was. I love that movie. And a stoolie, a stoolie reached out and was like, I have the whole poster signed by everybody. Do you want it? And I was like, that would be amazing. And I, I have two <laughs> things hanging in my entire apartment. That's one. <laughs> wow, that's so um, nice. One, one. Fran, toss it over to John. All right, let's go... Um... Let's go Seinfeld. Seinfeld. I love right. We a bunch of people use Seinfeld. Frank used Seinfeld. It might have just been Frank. I think Frank and, and Feist use Seinfeld. Seinfeld, here we go. Let's make it two to one. The season three premiere ends with the foursome eating at monks, watching what famous athlete dunking his donuts. Oh fuck. I'm pretty sure here. I'm not a hundred percent. Um Ah, fuck. I, uh, the name I thought of, I think I'm wrong. Mickey Mantle. Final answer. famous Yankee, I know that. Yeah. Oh. Joe DiMaggio. Joe DiMaggio. Damn it! it, is, oh, it so is famous I, knew, I knew it was the other one. I, could, I, just couldn't, I couldn't think of DiMaggio's name. I was like, who's the other one? Fuck. Joe DiMaggio. Uh, okay, John, for Fran. All right. Um... Honestly, just because I want to talk about it a little bit. Let's talk Lizzie McGuire movie. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Lizzie McGuire movie. Here, here this was this get, I will say, in terms of gauging difficulty for all these categories for these 16 matches, this was this movie was one of the toughest. Here we go. <laughs> As the end is written in a fireworks filled sky, animated Lizzie appears on screen with an ode to what Disney character to close the movie. Oh, as the end is running apart. 
I don't know. What band is Envy and Lizzie? Uh, 10 seconds. I'm just going to throw out like five. The fairy godmother. Three final answer. Yeah. Right track, but that's wrong. It's uh Tinkerbell. Tinkerbell. Oh yes. I was thinking she, I was like, she's got the little wand in her hand. Yeah. Yeah. Tinkerbell. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, here we go. We're knotted up one to one Fran. What are you going to give to John? Um, all right, let's go with, uh, Let's go one hard uh, new girl question. New girl, difficult. Are you going to double this or no? Um. Uh, no, no. I'll, I'll save it for Sunny. New girl. In season three, episode 16, Winston and Birdie host a dinner party where all of the courses are what type of food? Baloney. Final answer. <laughs> No, you gotta <laughs> you gotta chew it to soften it. You gotta let it sit in your mouth to soften it. it. It's it's soup. Oh, but someone's eating a bologna sandwich at dinner, and you gotta <laughs> you gotta you gotta chew. I think Nick might be eating a bologna sandwich because you gotta let it sit in your mouth to soften it before you can chew it. Yeah, all the all the courses are are it's soup. Oh man, <laughs> someone's they're at dinner. This is when okay. This is when. They are Winston and Birdie are first meeting. They're looking for a cat. I, I think this is the scene I'm remembering. And I, I'm, someone eats a bologna sandwich, I think, there. But, uh, <laughs> I will find out who eats the bologna sandwich. Okay. John, what are you going to give to Fran for a chance to take a 2-1 lead? I'm going to throw Fran a little 1D action. All right. One Direction. Here this we go. This is the one I'm least confident in. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Throwing it out there. This is the one I don't know why I included. One Direction. Here we go. What is the title of the twenty third of this twenty thirteen One Direction song? Title. Can play it again three more times. Yeah, can you play it again? This is the this is where I'm like oh the, the, ten the, seconds two more plays, one more time. Don't Five, don't don't four, three. Don't forget don't forget your home. Happily happily happily, happily one to one. Is that a song on the album? I'm making that up. Oh no! Uh, I, don't, <laughs> I don't remember that song, but I'll tell you what: one D bangs every time. Yeah, they do. Yes. They do. Okay. We did. We did. We did find. We did find the meme of the bologna sandwich. That was a different episode. Uh, different episode. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I knew I was getting that one wrong. There was no way. I was just unsure why I included that. Okay. No blood. We're evened up, though. Didn't matter yeah. either side. Here we go. Okay. One to one. What are you gonna give John um, next? John, let's go uh, curb. Curb. I, I I will say there's a couple categories I loved writing and Curb, Veep, Seinfeld were all up there. Here we go. Curb your enthusiasm. I think Chief went one for two on this. I forget. Uh, Chief also had Curb. Here's your Curb question to make it two to one. What is the name of the restaurant reviewer who causes issues for Larry in the season three finale after Larry breaks his fingers in dodgeball? Fuck. We would accept last name only here because they do reference him by last name only for most of the episode. I would accept that. We noted that. Yeah, I, I'm not going to know. Never for it. sports. Fuck. Sports always full name. The, you know, I, I, I remember him vividly. I could probably do a caricature of him. <laughs> uh, he yells at his assistant to cut his own meatballs for him, but I don't know the name. Uh, it is. <laughs> Uh, Portico, Andy Portico. Portico, fuck. Larry man. breaks the shit out of his fingers. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> very funny episode. Again, the the writing of these matches has just led me to rewatching so many shows and episodes, and I just get <laughs> lost watching them. 
Um, all right, one to one stalemate fights. What are you gonna give Fran? Um, Fran, let's go. Uh, let's go, Joe Bro. You just said Joe Bro show last night, I believe. So let's check. Yeah, it out. one to two. So God, let's hope I get I, one. We, of these, I right? I did not change the the songs based on it, but I did check the the set list. I was like, I they played every anything. song. So <laughs> they, the the Yankee Stadium one, I scrolled. I'm like, this is still going. It was like 60 songs. Yeah, I couldn't. They believe only it. played a snippet of a lot of them, but yes. Um. Okay. Here we go, Jonah. Do you want to double? Um. No. No double for Fran to make it two to one. Here is your Jonas Brothers regular difficulty question. What is the title of this 2008 Jonas Brothers song? That is BB Good. Final answer? Yep. That is correct. Two to one, Fran with a lead. No doubles used yet. Fran, what are you going to toss over to John? Let's go. Um, let's go because now we got a bunch of the same. Let's go easy or easy. Always sunny. Always sunny. Here we go. Do you want a double? Ah, let's spice it up. Let's do a double. All right, double for a temporary lead. Fran does have all of her doubles left, though. Here's the question: Always sunny. Regular difficulty. In season three, we discovered D was called what mean nickname in high school because of her back brace? Uh, Aluminum Monster. Final answer? Yes. Three to two. John gets that one right. Other side. John, what are you going to give Fran? I am going to throw Fran Prisoner of Azkaban. Okay. Prisoner of Azkaban. Uh, this is movie. This is Prisoner of Azkaban movie, by the way, just yes. noting. Kelly obviously does some of the book ones. Fran did the movie. Here we go. Prisoner of Azkaban, make it three to three. When Harry approaches the bugger, what giant, ridiculous object eventually turns into uh, Dementor before Lupin intervenes? What is the object before it turns into a Dementor? What is the object... Just to be clear for 25 seconds, uh, it's a ridiculous object from someone else. Harry, It's the person before is what you're saying. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, okay, okay. Um, who goes before him? Fuck, run. I'm, I'm, go, I'm going out on a limb. I, 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 a a giant spider on roller skates? It's one of them. It's This one's Jack in the Box. There's a spider, oh. on, there's a spider on roller skates. This one's spider Jack on in the Box. Spider on roller skates. Okay. Fights Dude. slight lead, but Fran has not used a double yet, so we're That's essentially nice. tied. Fran, what are you giving I, John next? I I have seen Harry Potter arguably more than any other movie ever. Like I watch, I do Harry Potter marathons all the time. Whenever I see a Harry Potter question, I'm like, I don't even recognize half these words. I don't know yeah. how. <laughs> like it is always very confusing to me. It um, was either but, it like. Those were the two guesses in my mind. I went with spider instead of the, the jack of the box. Um, okay. Let's go. Um, Veep. Veep. Here we go. To make it four to two. Veep. In season three, episode nine, Selena uses a crate for her campaign speeches that we find out was reinforced with titanium and costs how much? $25,000. Twenty five hundred dollars. No, you gonna you keep? You didn't say final. You didn't say final. So <sighs> twenty five thousand just sounds so ridiculous. But I think that's what they said. I'm I'm gonna go twenty five thousand final. Twelve hundred. Twelve hundred. Ah, damn it! I was gonna to get tie that. it back up. Fran, though, remember has the extra double. John, what are you gonna give her? Um, Very celebrity funny. mashup. Doubled. I will I will double. Name the two celebrities mashed up in this photo to make it four to three Fran. That is <laughs> Eddie Redmayne and Josh Gad. Final answer. Wow. <laughs> that is I think this is my first time ever playing Fran. So this is my first time witnessing it live. That is some impressive stuff. 
<laughs> that, that also works way too well, that picture. I, I, I <laughs> yeah. that. Um, Four to three, four to three. Fran with a one-point lead after our sixth round. Here we go. What is John going to guess next? Uh, let's go 30 Rock. 30 Rock. Oh, here we go. 30 Rock. Do you want to double? No, I'm going to save it. But as will I say, 30 Rock is the arguably the funniest TV show of all time. It is definitely the funniest Thursday night NBC show. <laughs> it is. It, 30 Rock, again, so I'm referencing all the rewatches we did for writing this. 30 Rock, I actually did not because I'm like, this needs to be a separate pay attention to every episode and do a full binge it's again. So it's so good. So it's so good. 30 Rock to make it four to four. In season three, episode 10, what is the name of the evil Spanish soap opera character who looks a lot like Jack Donaghy? Dude! Dude! <laughs> no! Dude, dude, I was, I think when you asked me, I was watching 30 Rock and like the next episode after you texted me, uh, I was like, I was, this was the episode and I was like, that's a question Jeff would ask. And now that I'm here, I'm panicking and I can't think of it. Um, oh God. No. (laughs) Five, four. No, it's not. No, I'll, I'll help you out. I'll help you out. Generalissimo, generalissimo. Generally no! 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 <laughs> Golly, man. Uh, <laughs> generalissimo. Fuck. Uh, um, uh, John, what is Fran going to guess next? Uh, high, school, high School Musical, which I've never seen, by the way, despite being obviously a humongous f rock guy. That is surprising, actually. That does. Yeah. That is yeah. would, I, would I like it now? Would it hold up for me now? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I had a feeling, but I wanted yeah, to you would, have, you would have I bet you would enjoy like a couple things here and there, but maybe yeah. not like if you watched it back in the day. I think I've heard a song or two and been like, oh, this is pretty good. What's this? If I mean the, like the songs school. are good. I, I just yeah, don't they, like yeah. Um yeah. Fran to make it five to three. Do you want to use your double on this? You're gonna save it for one No, I'm long, saving though. it. Okay, one uh, high school musical. Finish these bop to the top lyrics. Kicking and scratching, grinding out my best, anything it takes to climb. Kicking and scratching, grinding out my best, anything it takes to climb the ladder. Ladder of success? Final answer? That is correct. The ladder of success. Five to three, Fran with a two point lead, evened up on doubles. John. Fran, what was he going to guess next? Um. All right, let's sprinkle in a tough one here. Let's do hard, always sunny. Hard, I'm always sunny. Always John, sunny do you want ones to, out of the way. Do you want to double this? It's either this or the office. I think I already doubled the sunny. I'm going to save this one for the office. Let's go with this regular. Interesting strategy. Okay, here we go. Always sunny, hard. In season three, episode nine, D worries the rapper she is dating might be mentally challenged. What is the rapper's stage name? Lil Kev. Final, Final answer. answer. Yeah. That is correct. Damn Five it. to four. Five to four. What is Frank? Oh, I'm going to get the that? office run wrong like an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, just because I want to see uh, Michelangelo paint. Let's go celebrity mashup hard. Are you going to double? Yep. This would be a seven to four lead. These are three celebrities mashed up in one photo. Oh, shit. We're this back this to is a celebrity mashup mashup. You did this in the yep. All-Star Week, the Battle Royale for uh, uh, mashups with Gia, Glennie, and Keegs. Here we go. Name the three celebrities mashed up in this photo to take a seven to four lead. This one okay, work. we got... Oh man, is that Lily Collins or? Yeah. Okay. Mark Ruffalo. Lily Collins and Benedict Cumberbatch. Final answer. Final. Yeah. Seven to four, Fran. That is correct. 
triple that match. That's a tough. Lily Collins is a tough one. That is not an easy. That, one. I thought I, it was giving Emma Watson vibes when I first looked at it. There's, there's. That's funny you say. That. There's a couple of years which I guess maybe people have said that. That when I was scrolling through her Getty, I'm like, that just looks like Emma Watson. That's crazy. Yeah, totally. Um, Watching to Fran do that is like, it's almost like I don't know if my eyes work the same way. <laughs> Because then once she says the name, it's like it's the, the reveals happen. I'm like, oh, yeah, that is Ruffalo. Yeah. Wow, like, it clearly is <laughs> Ruffalo. But I, I never in a million years would have got that. I, I tried to gas up Brandon in his match because, like, Fran would mash up. Kirk with, like, golf stuff or Springsteen is crazy, and people are, like, in awe. Brandon is just as good. Like, you're in awe of him when he does Cosby Show. But I said the fact that it's Bill Cosby, nobody cares. Like, nobody yep. cares. They're like, they're like, I yeah. can't. <laughs> nobody can give him the same. That's I said it's stopping fault. you from getting and really. No like, one is going to. No one is going to applaud him on that. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like truly insane how good he no, is at Cosby. Like, nobody not, gives him the credit. <laughs> it's not not impressive. It's just like you're just like ooh, cool. <laughs> yeah, you're like all right, whatever, dude. <laughs> um. All right, John, you're down by three, but you do have an extra double. You have six points left. Fran has five. Uh, what is John going to guess next? All right, I'm going to go with uh, hard Seinfeld. Hard Seinfeld. Here we go. Make it seven to five. In season three, we see the guys in a gym locker room with Jerry and Kramer referring to George as what type of basketball player? Uh, oh, my God. Oh my god. This is so embarrassing. This is what I know everyone's watching being like you you like this, like I can feel everyone hating me for not he's uh <laughs> I mean I know he gets the ball and shoots every time. It's not a shooter though. He's a fucking five. It's chucker, he's a chucker. Whew. Final answer? Yes. Chucker, that's correct. Yeah. Seven that used all the clock. I love it. <laughs> Seven to five. Needed that. Here we go. What are you going to give Fran? Uh, let's go rom coms. Rom coms. Are you going to double rom coms or leave for One Tree Hill? Leave in for One Tree Hill. One Tree Hill regular double. Fran will have that. John has two doubles left. Rom coms regular. A rare critical hit for a Netflix original, this 2018 rom-com featured the likes of Zoe Deutsch, Glenn Powell, Lucy Liu, and Tay Diggs. Should have doubled. Um, this is... Oh boy, is it Set It Up or The Set Up? The Set Up. Final answer. It's oh Set no, It Up. You said it. It's Set It Up. It's yeah. Set It Up. Oh no, I knew it was going to be either of those. Did Pete Davidson didn't even make the list? It, it is just set it up. Yeah, it's yeah. set it up. Oh, yeah, yeah, just not set it up. Not trusting on that one. Set it up popped in my head first. Not doubling was big though. Then that did yeah, save yeah. you. Okay, now back to John. John, uh, you have three categories left. You have one difficult, which you have to double the office, and then two regular. Um, new girl. New Girl. Do you want to double? Yeah. Doubled New Girl. Here we go. What is the name of the cat Winston takes ownership over from his cheating ex-girlfriend Daisy in season three? Hang on. Sorry. Everything uh, froze. And I, I Wait, didn't hear. Lose, I, I heard something John? about Daisy. John Feidelberg. I know. <laughs> oh, no. She was convinced you were going to – and this is worth two. I know. And, and you want to know the real bitch of it? Is that during all that fucking hubba below, I could see this. I knew the question. And I got I, – I, I, was, I was walking into this room singing songs so I wouldn't think about it, so I couldn't cheat. Um, One. It'd be a butterfly. Ferguson. 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 Oh my God. No, no. I can't believe That's, you know, I I just want to know. It's you, all right. You... That's just, I, I, me getting the setup question is just, we're, that's, <laughs> cancel each other out. I got to note that John used to be on a team accused of cheating. John was never accused of cheating himself. That was one of the more honest things I've ever seen. And then just you saying, I had that up for, for a full. We've, by the way, you didn't see us at home. He froze. You have to change rooms. He saw the question all the time. No cheat. That's an honest man. 
Uh, it, dude, I, I saw it. I was given an excuse in order to play on my phone. I would not look it up. I am a non-cheater. Uh, John, toss it over to Fran. She can take a three-point lead now. Uh, Fran, we are going to go. Let's go back to Lizzie, please. Okay. Lizzie McGuire to make it seven or uh, eight to five. This means now, that w- I will say the setup of when I sent what questions I want doubled, knowing that there was a hard level <laughs> to each of those, I probably would not have picked the Lizzie McGuire movie to be for to be twice, but we shall see. <laughs> Lizzie McGuire. We really didn't understand the the how this was gonna work. No, the Steels thing I should have noted. I did almost kind of purposely not say that but now we know if you move on the second round you can change it while yeah. she's a chaperone in the movie what is miss ungermeyer's full-time job as explained by gordo to matt in the airport what is her actual job she's the i don't know if i'm going to be too She's like a guided, like a. Five, four. I'm going to go with the, the high school guidance, college guidance counselor. She's the principal. They say oh. she's the ticket to go to Harvard, but she is the yep. high school principal. She's just yep. the principal. That was, I overthought that. They do say the college comment though. Uh, all I know, right. That's Seven. why I just remember Gordo saying, if I get in her good graces, it's a one-way ticket to Shoot, I overthought Two point that. Lead. Three point remaining on each side. Fran, what are you going to give John here? Um, let, let's let's go for all the marbles here. The, the the hard office question. You just save the office for the end. There it is. Yeah. Ha- wait, hard office. Yeah, hard office. Okay, this is it. She's looking to throw me out of the ring. Uh, if you don't get this, it's over. Simple as that. During the Benihana Christmas episode, Dwight wins the raffle at Karen and Pam's party. What was his prize? For, for The head just sunk for two points. For two points and the tie. Though Fran still has a double remaining if you get this. I'm genuinely sure. I thought I was going to do so good at this. I thought I was going to get, like, everyone. Uh... This shit is hard. This is really hard. You guys picked, uh, you got, look, like, you guys picked for sure more of the difficult ones. Because there are some that are, I guess, I don't want to say on the easier side, but much more I mean, I didn't down. know you could pick, like, restaurants I've been to before. Like, <laughs> you know, like, what? You mean, like, Dana, Dana Beer's high school hoops? He did lose, though. Yeah, Five. like, could I have just picked my own family? <laughs> Three, two, one, John. Walkie talkies. Fran moves on. It's walkie talkies. Like, I'm gonna do like trivia about my sister. Like I don't like this. <laughs> I will know all the people who picked their high sc- their own high school sports did not move on to the next round. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Was karma or I can't did not say move that. on. Me. Uh, Fran will not get her last two questions. We will save those. Oh. Can John, I let's mine? give you the regular office. Come on, we're gonna yeah. give you the regular office, John. I don't remember the walk. Like everything else, when it's been said, I've been like, "Oh yeah, I don't remember the walkie talkies." What was the name of the music video Michael and Dwight made for the Office merger orientation? A parody of an SNL skit. Grant and the Electric City, I believe. No, Scrantonicity. Scrantonicity. Nah, it's lazy, <laughs> lazy Scranton. Oh wow! Okay, oh, Scrantonicity. <laughs> um, Kevin's band. All three experts move on to the second round. Fran, you will be taking on Rudy. Uh, that's that's two booze. The booze ponies' hopes hinge on Will Compton, which will be <laughs> against Kirk, which you'll be seeing right oh, in boy. the next thirty seconds. Uh, <laughs> but the oh, booze boy. ponies, the booze ponies will be back. Very high fan vote back into the league. The uh, booze we'll ponies be... is a conglomerate. We're a collection. Uh, us individually are dumb people. If you get us <laughs> together, we got a little magic in us. But uh, when you separate us from our powers, it doesn't work out. Um, that's it. Fran takes the win. Moving on. We'll take on Rudy. One more first round match. You're about to see it. Kirk against I must have Nick Compton. Will Compton coming up next. Alright, the 
thousand one v one battle royale twenty twenty three rolls on uh, with the last first round matchup. The thirty two seed Will Compton, doubted by many, doubted by every single person, except we haven't heard from his one seed counterpart and one seed Kirk Minahan. Uh, defending champion, three-time MVP. That's all three MVP awards won by Kirk. Uh, I will note, uh, we've done this match already. I was going to maybe not say it, but there's just no way. To, there's no well, way I was to going fake to. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there's just no. There's, and just there's in no, case I lost even worse, I was going to be like, hey, you know, I hit uh, several questions I, out there. That I'll I say to- this. I, I don't want to give anything away for the, we did the dress rehearsal. We, now we're on Broadway, but. I will yeah. say Will played very well. He played very well in that match. So I, I'm I'm nervous. I don't. What happens if the What happens if the impossible? I what happens if Rocky knocks Apollo out here, Jeff? Is there, <laughs> We're gonna probably have to play a third time because I mean that seems reasonable. It becomes I don't, the best of three. Yeah. Okay. Which All right. uh, it okay? So Kirk, we recorded this once. Kirk won. Will played really well. It went he down. Did. I think probably the tenth round. Yeah, he played um, really well. We already went over this. We rehashed this. We don't have to go the, like we don't have to do a fake back and forth. But every person in this league or in this tournament has basically said if they, if Will scores more than three or four, they'll be shocked. He's got no chance. He held his own for quite a while against Kirk. He gets a second shot at this. Uh, he'll have to definitely win twice. He wins here today. But we're <laughs> doing this again. Um, and the I, I will say the the worst part. I told Kirk this the other day. Well, the worst part was when the match is over. We were like, eh, it's done. We may as well rip these extra questions for Will. Completely wasted him for no reason whatsoever. I know, uh, dude. Yeah, I got. I got. Oh, he doesn't uh, remember. Now I'm nervous. I, I, I don't. Think. <laughs> <laughs> um, there we go. Ask the same ones because I think Kirk's right. <laughs> uh, here we go. Um, as always with this tournament, they picked eight categories. Uh, four of them will repeat. Uh, the first eight categories, the regular difficulty, they can uh, they can double two times. And then the difficult categories, the four repeating the ones that are going to be more difficult, they can double up once each. The winner takes on Roan uh, from the Yak, who took uh, took down Chief from Chicago, and basically the 8-9 matchup of the tournament, the 16 versus 17 seed. Uh, Kirk, you will give Will his first questions, mm-hmm. his first categories. Mm-hmm. Will, you'll do the same uh, for Kirk back and forth. Here are Will's categories. Uh, Rocky, Rocky 2, Friday Night Lights, the movie. Wedding Crashers, The Lion King, the cartoon, Rocky IV, Jurassic Park, Will Compton, Mm -hmm. uh, and then his repeating for The Lion King, Rocky IV, Jurassic Park, Will Compton. For what it's worth, when we recorded this the first time, Will got his difficult Will Compton question, did not get the regular difficulty Will Compton question. Uh, And then Kirk. Your category is Billboard Top. If you've watched the Kirk Battle branded in the All-Star game, you're going to recognize a lot of these. Basically, pick the same crop. Oscars Best Picture. If you're looking for Rocky Three, Kirk has Rocky Three, so they covered the first four movies. Bruce Springsteen, Freddie Couples, Born in the USA, uh, the album, Larry Bird, and then the History of the Eagles, the documentary. Yep. Uh, the documentary about the Eagles. Uh, and then Freddie Couples, Born in the USA, Larry Bird, and History of the Eagles do repeat. Uh, let's try this again. Uh, last match of the first round. Next week, the second round will begin. Winner takes on Roan in the second round, who won an early match here in the first round. Kirk, what do you want to give Will first? Let's, uh, let's go. He did well with these. Let's go Rocky 2. All right, Rocky 2. Here we go. He did. He didn't miss a Rocky question no, last night. Well, I mean, no, no, no. You, got help. you got help with one of them, but yeah, that's true. That's true. That is true. <laughs> <laughs> We didn't and I need that. I need that, that lifeline again. That fair enough. That's fair. My, that's reasonable. Yeah, that's we'll, we'll got a we'll got an unexpected call, Kirk lifeline. Um, <laughs> here we go. Rocky two. During the press conference to build the rematch, Rocky lists off things he'll do with his pay from the fight, including buying Paulie what? Thirty seconds. Man, I can I can see it. Paulie, what do you like? Ten God, seconds. Is it a fucking watch? I know we tossed it in. Five, four, three, two. I'm gonna say watch. Final answer. Oh. Snow cone machine. Snow cone machine. Uh, you knew that one, Kirk. 
Yeah, he said, you like, snow, you, you like snow cone machines, Paul. He says, yeah. Remember, he's, he's sitting on the side during the press yeah. conference. Yeah. Paul's like, what, who are you, Al Capone? He's got the outfit on. Uh, that's no a tough blood one. That's a tough uh, for, for Will in the first one. What do you want to give Kirk for his first category? Let's go. Let's go Rocky three. Let's stay in the theme. Yeah, all right. Uh, Rocky three. We're, yeah, we're going to stay in the universe here. Here's Kirk's one Rocky category. Rocky three to make it one to nothing. Before his fight with Clubber Lang, what do Rocky join the circus? Do? Final answer. <laughs> Here we go. That's one to nothing. Kirk, other side. What do you want to throw, Will? Uh, what do you want, Will? Let's stay Rocky. You want to do it? Okay. Uh, Rocky four. Rocky four to make it one to one. This is for Will. What sport was Drago's wife Lamilla an Olympic athlete in? Ten seconds. Just the overall sport. Five, four. Can we say three. Uh, let's let's track? Uh, swimming. Oh, swimming. that pains me so much. I was going to say swimming, but as a joke. Uh, swimming, <laughs> tough start. Kirk. That's a very uh, tough Will, start. What are you going to give him? Larry Bird. Larry Bird. Uh, any double here, Kirk? No, 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 no. No double on Larry Bird to make it two to nothing. With Bird playing only four games due to injury, the final playoff series of his career was Cavaliers. Uh, Clay Cavaliers, final answer. That is correct. Two to nothing. No doubles used yet. Uh, back over to Will, Kirk. Uh, Just for context, I believe it was 2 2 last game. Just. It was 2-2 two, two last game. <laughs> I know. It's, uh, it's, I know. This is painful. This is painful. Um, hmm. All right. Well, uh, wedding cra- I think you got, you got wed- wedding crashers. Wedding crashers. We'll get wed- wedding, we'll wedding crashers. You'll get this one. <laughs> wedding crashers. Here we go for Will. He did get this one last time. It was uh, nunchucks was the answer last right, time. Here right, we go. Right, right. Before going on their first set of weddings, what does John show Jeremy that they'll use to ensure they won't pay for any drinks? Um, Purple Hearts, final answer. On the board, Will Compton, that is correct. Two to go. one. You needed that. Two to one. Uh, no one's going no to gonna see this. No one's going to see this anyway, Will. It's going to get erased, so don't even worry. <laughs> this is do, you and I are going to do this every week for the rest of our lives. It's just, <laughs> we're never going to advance. So. Yeah. So every we've recorded so many matches after that people are like, "What's the bracket?" They're like, "Wait, what's wrong with that?" I go, "Don't." I think the tournament's this. done, right? I mean, we're playing the we're, <laughs> the winner goes to the finals. <laughs> uh, um, all right, what are you gonna give Kirk? Will let's go uh, history of the Eagles documentary. History of the Eagles documentary for Kirk. I'll double. Here we that. go to make. You're gonna double it, okay? Sure. Doubled yeah. up for Kirk. Tough, One of though. his <sighs> two regular mistake. difficulty doubles. That might have been a mistake. What nickname did the band members refer to Don Felder as for his ability on the guitar? Uh, Fingers Felder was his nickname. Final answer. That is correct. Fingers, four to one. Four to one. Okay, back over uh, to Will. Keep in mind, Will's not used any doubles yet. What are you going to give Will? Um, Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park for uh, for Will. Here we go. Well, uh, let's say, can I, can I double? Fuck, you don't ask me if yeah. I can double, Jeff. <laughs> you can double, yeah, you can double. God. I'm trying to stay I was going up it. doubles from last time. That was why. Okay, you can double. Here we go. You doubling, yeah? Jurassic Park. Yeah, double. Double Jurassic make, Park. There you go. To make it four to three, Jurassic Park. After Lex is able to get the phones working again, what do Grant, Sattler, and the kids try to travel through to evade the Raptors? To evade the Raptors? They get the phones working again. I mean, 20 seconds. I mean, it's got to travel through to evade the Raptors. What are you, uh, like, are, are you talking, like, what? 
Uh, upon, what? Sorry, what you're like you're you're saying like what do the kids travel through to evade the Raptors? Like Grant Sattler and the kids travel through to evade the Raptors. Are we they go through about... something to evade the Raptors. I paused just for a clarification. They go through some of the trade. Need it in five, four. I I, I mean fuck the jungle. I I I'm not. I don't know. I hate the jungle. The jeep. Air ducks. They go through air ducks. They travel through events. The air ducks. What kind of fucking question is that, Jeff? <laughs> what do you mean? It's Perfectly a... reasonable question, Will. What do you mean? A... <laughs> air ducks? Would ceiling have worked? <laughs> I might have. Oh. I might have taken ceiling. Jungle you, you, was but not you, great. But you, but you didn't. Get, but you didn't guess ceiling, though. You're, you know, you're, you're right. But I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to think of all the times they're like literally running from raptors, like the entire fucking movie. Well, it's, I mean, it is okay. Well, yeah. <laughs> four, to four to one. Four to one. All right. Four to one. Back uh, over. What are you going to give Kirk? Oh, uh, fuck. I don't know. Born in the USA. I God like damn it. Will makes me laugh. Go ahead. <laughs> Born in the USA. Born in the USA. Here we go. This is for Kirk. Do you want to double? I'm starting to think that maybe Will's little kid was giving him answers last time. I don't know. <laughs> that's true. No. He also not only. Oh, that's well, a, that's what's was... crazy is my mind was everywhere the last <laughs> I mean, game, and we're fucking in a tight race. Will was literally. <laughs> Will's kid was like he was hanging his kid upside down. He was like hiding it. He was running <laughs> he, around. He and was, the, the he thing was hearing paused. questions with like three it was seconds. Inc- left. It was unbelievable. <laughs> it was incredible. It's lost to history, but it was incredible. Uh, <laughs> Go ahead. That's so bad. Uh, I feel so USA. fucking bad. Uh, Born in the USA. Here we go. This is for this is for Kirk. No double. What is the title of this 1984 Bruce Springsteen song? No surrender. Final answer. No surrender. Final answer. Five to one. That is correct. All right. Back over to Will. Ten points left for each. Four point lead for Kirk. Um, Rocky. Rocky. Do you want to double regular Rocky? First Rocky. No. Here we go. Rocky. Should have, for should have. You know what? Yeah, yeah. Can I double? You can double. You said it quick. You said it quick enough. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah let's just, I, I got to We try see to Rocky do fight. a loan collection early in the film. What is Rocky supposed to break if the guy doesn't give him $200? His finger. Final answer. Hold on Did one you hear second. me? Yeah, we're getting yeah. we're getting a note from. Yeah, we'll take that. That's that correct. Counts. Five that counts. Five to three. That counts. Yeah, five to three. What five was the three. exact answer? Thumb specifically, but yeah, we'll take I'll, finger. Five I'm to three. Yeah. Okay, two point lead. Back to Kirk. Will, what are you going to give him? You both. Uh, Will, you have um, no doubles left on regular Kirk. You have one left. Okay. Freddie Couples. I'll double that. Freddie Couples. All right, double Freddy Couples. Uh, you know to what? Make can it... I not? Can I actually? Can I not double? I'm sorry. Can I? Or is it too? You haven't shown it yet. Yeah, you're fine. To make it uh, six to three. I'll hold off. I'll hold off. Freddy Couples. Mm-hmm. He's trying to run up the score. God. Couples helped the USA win the 1991 Ryder Cup with a three and two victory over what early 2000s? Sam European... Torrance. Final answer. That is correct. Six to three. Can we get some level of parody in this in this match, Jeff? What? I mean, could play I mean you hear second. how. I can play He's against myself. Like, I mean, uh, yeah, I don't know. God, like last, you were like, oh, Will's answering questions within three seconds. All of a sudden, I perform at some high level, and Jeff's like, okay, now I got to get Will. Wait a minute. Wait not a even minute. knowing wait, what the fuck's going on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait and, a minute. And, and Kurt lie, gets to sit here. And he's, he's still answering questions before it even gets out of your mouth, Jeff. I do it every match. What are you talking about? <laughs> can we get some more difficulty? That's all I'm asking for. Just a little bit more parody, Kirk. I mean, when you guess jungle, the duck, the air fucking... ducks, I don't know. Yeah, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, that's, okay, all right, all right. Back over to Quill. I we'll see how you do this next Jesus. Yeah, the jungle, that's a, that's a fair argument. That's a fair argument. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> oh, I'm picking. I'm sorry, Will. Um, well, he seems like a complicated guy. It seems like there's two of them. So maybe I'll take Will Compton here. I don't know which one we're going to get. So I'll go, I'll go Will Compton. Nice guy here, or the bad is, boy. I don't know. This is the ultimate, like, let's get some parody. Here's the category about yourself. Here we go. Uh, for, for Will, about Will Compton. Will set his career high for QB hits in a game during the Week 16 of the 2015 season when he hit what Eagles QB twice during a 38-24 win? Sam Bradford, 
final answer. <laughs> a quick answer that. Six to four. The only sack I had in my career. Oh, God. Thank God. All right, back like, over. like with Kirk, you need like specific words from a sentence. I don't need that. <laughs> back over to Kirk. What are you going to give him? Let's go, uh, I don't know, Oscar's best picture. I'll double that. Oscar's best picture to make it eight to four. Make it eight to four. Here we go. In the year Unforgiven took home best picture, this 1992 period romantic drama featured Anthony Hopkins and Emma Thompson. Fucking doing this again. You you wouldn't. You wouldn't do this to me. Howard Zen, final answer. That is okay. correct, Howard Jesus Zen. Was Christ. that the was that yes. the one from It remains of the okay. day? I guess I was in the same fucking position again. I was I, I, I fucking with that that I, uh, that's that's a tough one. That's a tough uh, one. Jesus. Eight Christ. to four, two regular left, seven points left for each person. Kirk, what are you gonna give Will next? Got Lion King uh, and Friday Night Lights. Lion King. Lion King. Off the board for Will. Here's your question. In the beginning of the movie, Scar replies with what when Simba asks him, what will that make you after he becomes king? The exact line is, when I become king, what will that make you? It's kind of a weird question to write, but so I'll give you that explanation. When Simba asks him, what will that... Simba, 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 asks him, Simba what says, that when I become Scar? king, what will that make you? What does Scar reply? Um, better, but I am an idiot. Just remember that. Pretty tough question, though, to be fair, honestly. <laughs> An answer in five, four, I don't know. three. That's something six. uncle work. Say it again. Something uncle. Like, can I say, like, just uh, an uncle? I'll give you five seconds more specific. Five, four, three, <laughs> two. Uh, <laughs> monkey's one. uncle. Final answer. <laughs> that, is, that is correct. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! God, I was like, man, I was like, <laughs> man. Uh, that was that, that. That was. It's not like bending the rules, but there are like certain things you can do in this game. Like you say, it's, I not, like, that. it's not like, like bending the, the rules. For example, okay. Dave will <laughs> ask for the repeat of the music just to extend the time. If you're that not, was... va- if you're vague enough, I'll give you the five seconds specified. Um, okay. All right, eight to five. Back over to Kirk. Will, what are you going to give him? Um, Bruce Springsteen and eight to we've used we've used both our we've both used our doubles, right? Correct. Yeah, yeah. your okay. your yeah, yeah. difficult all, doubles are the only yeah, ones yeah. remaining. Gotcha. Gotcha. Uh, gotcha this gotcha. is regular Bruce for Kirk. Okay. Finish the lyrics to this 1978 Bruce Springsteen song. Regular Bruce. Got the faith to bear. Ain't got the faith to tear me down. Is that right? I always mess up that line. Is that right? Is that your final? Yeah. No, first myth. Faith to stand yeah. its ground. Oh, oh right. Faith to stand yeah. its ground. First myth. Did never, he leave never, the door open? I never know that line. I never know that line, the promised land. So that means that means again, this actually happened last one. KB only person to go per he only oh. had nine, but he went perfect. There you go. We got uh, here now. we go. Back over to Will. It's only Friday Night Lights of Well, you can technically we do change for the second round, we change the rules. This four the four difficult are saved for last. I assume you guys are just gonna clear the regular difficulty board. Uh oh, yeah, yeah, that's fine, right? Okay. Friday night lights for Will. Here we go. Which player was revealed to be the only Permian senior on the team to end up with a Division I scholarship? I'm going to go with uh, Preacher Man, final answer. Say it one more time. Preacher man. Yeah, that should that should we're just making sure. Yep, double checking. I forgot oh, I should have put the I'll take back, that. That's fine. Back over to make right. it uh nine to six billboard top one hundred. To make it nine to six, a three point lead going into the difficult round. Billboard top one hundred. This song ended up in the top twenty five for the Billboard year end hot one hundred in nineteen eighty six and even reached as high as number one at one point. Here it is. The same friends. 
Uh, Stuck with you by Huey Lewis in the news. Final answer. Nine to six lead going into the difficult round. Here we go. Your mind's uh, a bucket steel trap, Kirk. It's I get like the promised land man. lyrics wrong. I, that's what I can't believe. Suspicious. Um, Especially after just mm, going to a Bruce Springsteen concert. Two of them in two of them in three nights. Uh, uh, Rocky Four. Oh, I'm going right, Jeff. Whoop. Yeah, uh, over over to Kirk. I'm um, over to Will. Correct. R- Rocky Four. Rocky Four. Do you want to use your one difficult double or save it? No, no, I'll save that. Okay. I think I got to save it on myself. Oh yeah, you just get one double for this, right? Yep, here we go. That's for Will to make it 9-7. to Mm -hmm. During the press conference before his fight with Drago, Creed says he has retired more men than what? I've I've retired more men than Social Social Security, final answer. Got it. That is correct, 9-7. to Nice. Will Will, Will is, again, I'm telling telling you. Tough start, but he has a, once again, prove people wrong. We thought he'd score like four fucking points. Here we go. No question. Back over to Kirk. What are you going to give him? Uh, Let's go... Larry Bird. Larry Bird. Here it is for Kirk. After Bird stepped down as the Pacers head coach following the 2000 NBA Finals, what former foe of Bird's took over the position? Need something in. <clears throat> Five, four, three, two, one. Isaiah Thomas, final answer. <laughs> That's a backbreaker. That's tough. <laughs> ten to ten. Hey, yeah, you did that oh, on purpose. Yeah, right? I did that on purpose. Yeah, I did. God <laughs> damn. All I thought in my head was, hey, hey he misses this and says, what's <laughs> something? I got a double. It's so nine to nine. Over, like, who knows? It's still not over yet. I was very suspicious. I, I know it's not over, over, but that, I was thinking, like, man, he gets this. We might have. We might well, have I was thinking, like, I, I, for a shot. second, I was like, did it go right from him? Because I know Bird wound up firing him. So I was like, I didn't know how long the. I was thinking for a second. <laughs> but I had an idea. Uh, uh, back over to Will Kirk. What do you want to give him? Um, Jurassic Park Redemption. Jurassic Park Redemption. <laughs> Here it is to make it 10 to 8. In the scene where Sattler and Grant first meet Malcolm, Hammond says he's a mathematician. Malcolm corrects him, saying he's a what? He's actually a what? You're a... Uh... Corrects him, saying he's what? Like he's uh In the scene where Sattler and Grant first meet Malcolm. I'm thinking of the wrong scene. You need an answer in five, four. I don't three, know. Two, nothing. Nothing. I don't know. Chaotician, chaotician. It's like chaos. It's. Oh, it's not over yet because he can still double, right? Oh yeah, not over yet. Right. Not uh, over yet. He has three points. Uh, actually, well, if you get it here, it is a four-point lead. Right, three but points not over left. yet though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Here we go. What are you gonna give him, Will? <laughs> I don't fucking know, man. Let's go. Uh... Freddie Couples. Freddie Couples. For the win. Here we go. Freddie Couples. Couples went back to back at this unofficial PGA Tour event in 93 94. Uh, Kapalua Freddie... Invitational in Hawaii. Final answer. Kapalua will take. That's correct. That's the win. 11 to 7. Kirk <sighs> moves on to face run. I think it's the same exact score as last time. And well, I get now chaotic, I'm chaotic, chaotic addition. Chaotic addition. Cha- what the? It's just insane, man. Moving on, taking on Roan. Uh-huh. Uh, repeat performance here. Basically, kind of the same exact thing. Uh, defending yeah, champ. Was, uh, we'll, we'll play great. Yeah, like, you know, he had a stumble at the beginning, but then he played well. I, 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 third, no third, as I said last time. And I'll say when we do their group text thread again, next week when we do it again, he's no 32 seed. So we're going to keep... <laughs> If we keep doing this, he will beat me eventually. So I, we, where we just does have this to like playing. stack up? You've talked about the potential mini slam. You know, you've done yep. Yep. mini golf. You've done yep. the dozen regular. You have the mm. Ryder Cup coming up. We don't know that sure. yet. You're in survival bars. So like, yeah. is this 
is this slot in there? Yeah. Oh, I I, I guaranteed I was going to win this thing. So there's a, and I do think there's a huge bullseye on my back in this thing. Like I, I think everybody thinks I'm going to win it. So I see it on social media. So as you see with Will and these other guys, everyone's good at the things they know. Right. So, you know, uh, that's why the special questions are super specific. And that's why if people are complaining about the super specific questions, they're out of their fucking mind. Like this is what, this is what this tournament is. <laughs> it's super specific questions about super specific things. Uh, Will, well, I love that we, last, you know. we had a good, re- we had, we had a, I, I know Kirk and I, like our, our relationship as a whole is like ascending. And I know that jab there. It's, I still feel like the whole air duck thing is insane. No question. No question. No, this Matt. Oh, the, no the, 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 only, the only one I'm upset about is the swimming one because it's like that was the first one that came to my head. And I'm I thinking, knew that one. Oh, yeah. It wasn't, it wasn't swimming, but um, wrong. Jerry, and by the way, in the, by the, in the way, chaotic you, attition or whatever that was with Malcolm. Right. To be clear, too, this is, the, this is the, when you like somebody versus when you don't like somebody. If Brandon Walker had said fingers and the answer was thumbs, I would have driven to your fucking house, Jeff. And <laughs> no, yeah, you no, I know. Ocean. So <laughs> that's I mean, why you know. on that. That's why when I said uh, uh, preacher man, I was like, hey, I was fine with that. No, that's that no, I'm, I, no, no, that yeah, was, that was, that was fine. fine. Yeah, I'm, that, yeah, that one for sure. Um, even fingers was is okay, but it's just you know, it's when you don't like somebody is when you go for the jugular. So. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. Jared Cook, by the way, Will. Jared, Jared Cook, Cook, yeah. Um, Will Top Compton, NBA your booze bad. ponies already in season four of the Dozen Trivia League. We did a rebrand there. It's not competition. It's the league now. Uh, you will be in there in November uh, with Kirk's team. Uh, four teams will be joining the 12 teams already voted in. Booze ponies voted in with ease. Uh, that's it. Our division. Our, we're part of the division with Kirk? Uh, no, I mean, you're, you're still the league. Said? Yeah, oh, you're okay, just gotcha. – you're, you're, yeah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. You're straight we haven't up. played you guys yet. Yeah, we got to do that. Oh, that's the thing. I mean – Look, the dozen trivia leagues gonna be less teams this year. You're gonna, these teams are all gonna play each other at least once and much more. So, um, at least the big ones. So, uh, that's it for the first round of this tournament. Next week, uh, things kick off with the second round. Uh, Mark Titus against Brandon Walker, uh, KB versus Eddie. And then we roll on second round matches all next week. Kirk will be in there taking it on her own. Make sure to like and subscribe. We'll talk to you next time.